Jelly Roll, also known as Jason Bradley, born December 4, 1984. He was born in Tennessee and started his career in 2003. What the fuck? I did not know that. Jelly Roll is a multi-genre artist. He does country, rock, hip-hop, and country rap. Country rap? I've never knew that was a thing. Now that we have the basic overview of Jelly Roll slash Jason, let's get into the whole point of this video. I was scrolling through TikTok like this whole society is doing. Yeah, we're fucking cooked. But I scrolled across a video and it really sparked my mind. I scrolled over it at first and then I scrolled right back to it and I watched all four minutes. Here's a little scene of the video that I watched. Today I had the most unique experience I've ever had in a jail. It, it, it shook me to my core. A local county jail that has a program that is teaching people how to recover the right way. So yes, Jelly Roll went to a county jail. He had brought in four people from the jail onto stage to sing a song with him. And the song was perfectly built for them. <laughs> Golden buzzer. Is the golden buzzer loud? Psh, fuck yeah, it's my video. Golden buzzer. Golden buzzer. The first time I had watched this video, it literally made me tear up. I, I'm a huge believer in second chances. And I think this was such a good part on Jelly Roll. And these lyrics I had put on the screen for you guys, that means a lot. That little performance for those four young citizens could change their lives. So then... Givy ended up curious, and I searched Jelly Roll on TikTok, and you won't believe what I found. When I searched up Jelly Roll, these are the things that came up. It was multiple videos of Jelly Roll performing in jails with inmates. Inmates singing his song really loud and have passion into his song. So then I became curious and wondered why Jelly Roll was performing in jails so much. So then I realized Jelly Roll had served 15 years in jail with his second chance he is a professional singer he is succeeding in life he wants to show the inmates on what he had to do to show them that they can be successful later in life they won't always be like that after i went to go take a peek at a couple of jelly roll songs and i realized these lyrics are all meaningful they're all realistic they're all about his past life on what he had to do. And most of them are talking about how he didn't like his past self. But now look at him. He is succeeding. He's a good guy. He's showing what second chances actually are. I am not a country music fan. If you told me that Jelly Roll went to jail, I would not believe you because of how such of a good guy he is. I would not believe you if you told me Jelly Roll had went to prison for 15 years because of what he's doing with his life right now. Jelly Roll who brought four people on the stage who are beating themselves down, who don't know the person they are anymore, who are struggling in life, who are currently always staring at a blank wall, who don't know where their family is and how their family is doing. They don't know. Jelly Roll is showing that there is a bright, there's always a star. Jelly Roll showed these four inmates that there is a star in the light and that they will be successful. They just have to believe. They just have to praise. They just have to be themselves. Jelly Roll gave them the chance. This will, I'm 100% sure, that this will change their lives forever. My husband got off the internet because he is so tired of being bullied about his weight. Sorry that this is going a little bit off track, but I still wanted to talk about this because it's my video. <laughs> Him having to go completely off the internet because of how bad bullying actually is nowadays, it sucks. It's painful. It's hurtful. It's not good. I'm glad Jelly Roll is a great person. He knows that he is doing good in life. Later in this video, he quotes, I can't believe she came into my life she changed me he is constantly doing good things to the community he donated two hundred fifty thousand dollars to charity he's 100 percent supporting charity he's helping them he does everything he possibly can do to this community and that shows no matter what you do to help or what you do to help to give back to the community, it shows that the community is broken and not seeing the good side of Jelly Roll. I mean, there is only one good side. They're just bullying him because of his weight. He is a good person. He's constantly doing good things for his community. He dropped an album this year. 
I'm probably going to have to give it a listen. I appreciate you all watching this. And what's your favorite Jelly Roll flavor?